Hi guys! In today's video, we will make this cute mermaid inspired swimwear set for your dolls. Since I like everything about mermaids and also glitter and sparkles, this is right up my alley. You can use this method to make this set for any doll that you want. I'll be using my PJD for this video. The first thing I did was to cover the top of the doll in kitchen film, and then I essentially made paper mache on top of it using newspaper and glue in order to kind of build a basis for the cups of the top of the bikini. The reason I did this was to make sure I had the proper structure beneath the fabric I was going to be using. I did two complete layers before doing the other side and then let it dry completely. Peel them off the kitchen film and then cut around the edges to smooth it out. And that's the base for the top. For the fabric, I'll be using this stretchy swimsuit material, which has this pattern on it which reminded me of mermaid scales. Gradually glue the fabric on top of the cups, making sure that you stretch out the edges so you don't get wrinkles. Cut away any bulk around the edges and then glue them inside. Next you're gonna cut out a piece of fabric in the shape like this, making sure it can go all the way around the doll and overlap, and then you're gonna glue the two cups onto it. It's beginning to take shape now. Now you wanna take a piece of velcro and use this to close the back. And that's how to make a basic bikini top or bra if you will. If you want to keep it strapless then go right ahead. I just decided to add straps because I like the look using a piece of ribbon. And now for my favorite part, decoration. I use some rhinestones, beads and dried flowers and also some seed beads in order to make some strings of beads. In my mind, mermaids are just as vain as people, so I think they like to dress up. That's why I also go for a very shiny, glittery theme whenever I'm doing mermaids.
when you have a little look at the top, set it off to dry and then we can work on the bottom. In order to make my pattern for the bottoms, I covered the doll in kitchen foam and tape so I could draw on the pattern on her. Cut out the pieces so you can transfer them onto paper. And here's the finished pattern for front and back. The good thing about working in stretchy swimsuit wear like this is that you don't have to worry about the edges fraying. Transfer the pattern pieces and cut them out. Place the pieces right sides together and sew them. And that's the basic swimsuit bottoms. Now you can add decoration to them if you want. Of course I did. Let it dry and then the swimsuit's done. I really like how this set turned out, I really think it's super cute. I think this goes super well with the pink wig that I made for my doll recently. If you want to see how to make that, I'll add a link at the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching, hit the like button if you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in a new one real soon, bye!